After the queen saw the statue, she felt like the it doesn't resemble the king enough. So a lakh of these is what lights up the palace in the night. Ninety thousand. Wow. This is the picture of the same place. Long, long time ago when there was nothing here. <laughs> yes. Devraja Market. And look at it now. Soaking in the markets of Mysuru. Bariyatta, 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 bariyatta. <laughs> no, you have it first, and you tell me what it's like. Yeah, really, is that good? That your eyes lit up. Ah, so hot. That is a toppa. So obviously, if you take sarees and a humble Vinayaka Mahilari dosa, guess what the boss has chosen. Is that? One and a half lakh. It's good for getting married. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's a dosa that's absolutely fragile. Huh? Nice and fluffy. Best of Mysore is a history plus food walk by Gully Tours. So somebody by name is here is gonna come. I'm looking forward to it, but something different. Something to do with food, right? I'm sure. No, it's not just food. It's like whenever I like, I've been to Mysuru so many times in the last two, three years. But every time I've come here to shoot, it's always been about the food. Right. So that's why I'm looking. So more than the food, I'm looking forward to the introduction to Mysuru's history, in a manner of speaking, through the walk. Okay. Sanskrit Pasita. So we started off here. We'll walk through the cities. So this is a photo that was by Taib Mehta, an abstract picture of Maisha Sura. Okay. So do you guys know who Maisha Sura is? Yes, of course. Yeah. So Mysore is named after him. So it stands for Maisha Sura na Uru. And then after the British came by, came Mysore. Great goddess Chamundeshwari. And she comes about and kills Maisha Sura. So that is the story of Dasara as well. Right? So there was a battle for 10 long days, at the end of which she emerged victorious okay. and Mahishasura was dissolved. And so that's why Mysuru? Yeah, Mahishasura Uru. Mahishasura na Uru. People pulled in their money and they built this clock tower for them. In the corner there, in the right, a small lock. The person actually opens the lock, squeezes into the window, and there's a long spiral staircase that takes him all the way to the top. Okay. And he winds the clock. And is quite accurate too. And what about the other one which is there on the other side? Uh, Chik Gadiara. Chik Gadiara. Small clock. So even is that also wound by a similar. It's the same person. Oh, the same person? Yes. But it's got a little easier there. It just has to climb a ladder. No squeezing through windows. So that came up later. That was the first one. So that's the new one, and that's the old Freemasons. And that's because the Maharaja was a free. Okay. okay. Jai Chamaraja Vade. Okay. Right, so do you notice any color difference between the face and the rest of the body? Is the face whiter? Correct. Huh? Right. So initially, the statue was commissioned by the Queen, given to a person called Robert Colton. Okay. So he was the one who did the entire statue. Okay. But after the Queen saw the statue, she felt like the it doesn't resemble the king enough. So she hired another sculptor by the name Ganpat Rao Matre from Maharashtra who came around and then redid the whole face again. So he used a different marble which is why it's... It's whiter. Uh. Actually the fourth palace in the same exact place. 
so there were three palaces before it. The first one was destroyed in a lighting. The second one was destroyed by, at least allegedly destroyed by Tipu. Okay. The third one is the wooden palace that is painted there. Ah, okay. So during the princess's wedding, that the fire down. engulfed the whole kitchen and the palace. And the current palace has been like this. It's an indo saracenic style. Do you notice a golden yeah, the dome, dome on top? Yeah. So there used to be a light that could glow red or green, depending on whether the royal family was inside, especially the king. And after, you know, they decided, okay, India is a democratic country. We shouldn't have the notion of kings and royalty. It always glows red. Okay. So in the night when you pass by, you could just look into. The yeah, you we saw it yesterday. Yeah, that's why it glows red. How many light bulbs it takes to light up the whole? It's about ninety thousand. Ninety thousand. Okay. One lakh. Ah, Sri is right. So a lakh of these is what lights up the palace in the night. Ninety thousand. Wow. Of Mysore. Earlier, the entire city of Mysore used to live within the port. So the palace is in the heart of the city, right? And after a while, a plague broke out, and they decided that okay, having all of them in a small cramped place isn't a good idea. Yeah. So they decided to expand the city. So you find that there are a lot of different places like the Lakshmi Mall, uh, Sarsi Puram. So based on the profession, they were designated a part of the city where they live. Oh, okay, so based on the profession, they went there. So yes. Sarasuti Puram is what the the place the, where the scholars, the, the scholars. Live. Ah, okay, and the Mandi Mohalla is a market. Yeah. Ah, okay, so that's how the places came up. Okay. And there's also a place called Lakshan Mohalla. That's where the people, the army. Ah, okay. This is a picture of the same place. Long, long time ago, when there was nothing here, <laughs> yes. Devraja Market. And look at it now. And that, of course, is the chick gadiara. Chick gadiara. So ah, that's again wound, hand wound. Yes. Yeah, so do you see a ladder there? Ah, correct. So the person who winds up the other clock pulls on the ladder, winds up, and mechanically winds up. The winds clock. up. Okay. Any guesses how many stores are there inside? Shri is good at guessing. Shri. <laughs> Is How much did you say? 800 to Wow, okay. that's uncanny. <laughs> Soaking in the markets of Mysuru here at Devraj Woods Market, right? Devraja Market. Those are mango leaves, Shri. <laughs> Fruits. Yeah. So since India is a tropical country, we have a lot of tropical fruits, uh -huh. and we have a separate lane for bananas. Any uh -huh. guesses why? Because this is the land of bananas. <laughs> uh, Elaki and all of that. Yeah, it's matching with your shirt. I came dressed for this. <laughs> this is why they have a separate lane for bananas is because bananas, when placed with other fruits, uh -huh. tend to ripen the other fruits faster. faster. Right. Oh, okay. So therefore, an exclusive. And this was back in the day. Yeah, they planted like this from the beginning. Itself. Wow, and I don't think any of our modern markets do that, right? No, no. Right next to so basically, the bananas ripen the other fruits faster. Yes, so they release ethylene, which ethylene. ethylene yeah. So they have these special places, and they keep the unripened bananas in there, so they can ripen without interfering with it. So it's called the Nanjingur Raspale. Nanjingur is a place nearby. It has its own GI tag. It has a rich red soil. It's a very citrusy taste to the banana. Go for it. You have. Like no, you have it first, and you tell me what it's like. Yeah, really, is that good? That your eyes lit up? Nanjan good is a rasa bale, handu. It's a little sweet and also a little sour. Yes, we like to call it the banana because it tastes a little bit like apple as well. Oh, because lovely. Notes in the back. And the tartness, basically. And the tartness, that's right. Yeah. Huh? See, I have one. It's only see there, Mathe Sulpa, Huli Kudai there. No? Very nice, very interesting. So, you know, 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 The ones that have a trunk that look like an elephant is a nanjan gudu. Shri has fallen in love with the bananas. As I long don't blame her, it's amazing. As long as I don't have to hold it, <laughs> I'm okay.
We thought we'll try the Nanjan Guru Rasa Bale yeah, Hindu. Very good. Yeah, it's a good it's a for health also. It's a rare species. Rare species. Yeah. Newly Mysore now, right? Mysore. Oh, very nice. What are your names? Seshagiri Rao. Mr. Seshagiri Rao. Your Hi. sons, your kids? Yeah. Oh, nice. Thank you very much, madam. What's your name? Rupa. Lovely. Nice yeah. to meet you. Thank you. Uh, Everywhere. That's yeah. my wife. Hi. Hi. Shri. Yes, I go tasting every food. Ah, correct. Ella Thank you very much. Thank you. Happy Ganesh. Happy, Happy Ganesh, Ganesh, Ganesh Chaturthi. See you. Happy Gauri Ganesh. See you. Good luck. Good luck. Bye. Thank you. Bye. 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 So if you don't need a lot, you can just come and take. It's a lot of ginger for 10 rupees and a lot of turnips as well, beetroot. Oh, that's the bhaji, mensin kai bhaji. So, does he also make the bhaji out of it? That I would be interested too. So, it's called on GI tag. It's so the most flavored among the class of jasmine. Mysore Malliga. And your company is like Chanel and Dior. So, come over and put your there. Namaskara, Chanagi Dara. Bari Pattu. Takoli, Takoli. North Dira. Okay. Can you get it? Well, it's nice to meet food lovers everywhere we go. Even in Mysuru's Devrajur's market, this is the flower lane. Jaggery. So this comes from where? Mandia, the sugar cane. Exactly. The sugar cane pulp is molded into shapes like this. Is it a kempo ya ke do? And they're so sweet. Instead of flies, you get honey base. Thank you, sir. Right. Well, when you emerge from that market after spending 20 minutes, just taking in this open atmosphere is like a breath of fresh air. But it's quite an experience. So if you come to Mysuru and you really want to soak into the food culture, not just the food culture, but the produce in terms of where the vegetables, the fruits, the bananas, you should definitely look it up. Ah, North Dira. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Nice meeting you. Nice meeting you too, madam. So we've stopped for some nice sofa. Eradu new tuppa do kodi. Eradu piece kodi. Mathe eradu nim do hard adu. Okay, one jangir gula kodi, sir. Hesh tai do? Huh? Ella share kondo. Shri is already talking into the Mysore Park. What's the verdict? So it was their ancestors, Kakasura Madhapa, who first made the Mysore Park, right? In the royal kitchens, right? Exactly. And therefore, the paka, which is sugar syrup, mm -hmm. right? It's a sweet made with the paka. Yeah. And therefore, Mysore Paka, yeah. correct? Correct. Okay. So for once, I know something that you know as well. Go for it. Ah, so hot. That is a tuppa. The roasted flavors, right? Of the gram flour and the tuppa. And of course, the sugar is what brings it all together in that rich, lush sweetness with all that ghee. Fantastic. Oh, this is. Ooh. How is it? This is the Guru Sweet Mysore Park experience. And there's nothing like eating that Mysore Park warm. So I think even when you buy it from here and take it home, heat it for a few seconds. Because you want some of that tuppa to emerge from that Mysore Park. From that Mysore Park. 
Look at all that ghee. All that ghee. That has seeped into that newspaper. Ooh. Stick over it. Come on, don't waste it. Then you have to have it. How can you waste? Mysore Bak. Oh, Vanaspati. That's why the texture is harder. So it's more biscuity. You prefer that? When they take it out and they put it in the tray, that bottom is still cooking. Whereas the top cools faster. That's why you see that gradation in that color. Of course, this is more biscuity, but this also stays for a longer time. This stays for a longer time compared to this one. Mm. When I was a kid, this used to be my favorite sweet. Yeah. Some jahangir? I don't have a sweet tooth. Oh, okay. Some kara. Balance things out. Nice flavor of the Oma, the Ajwain in that. Ah, well, the market done and some Mysore Park they said Namaskara, Chanaki Dira. Chanaki Dira, sir, mobile North Arthur. North Dira, new. Okay, thank you. Lord thank you very much. Allah, Allah, Nakla, Kaida, Fred, Book, Martilla, Tintera, sir, you are the Tintera, sir, no, 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 Otto, driver wanted to know if I ate all that. Well, I don't have any special effects. I eat all that you see me eating in the show. Speaking of eating, we've just done the, the Devrajar's market. We've done the Mysore Park. And we are on our way to taste something else, which is rather special from a Mysuru street food scene. More about it when we get there. Are you ready? Oh, yeah, I'm ready. Fantastic. And we've uh, managed to hijack Sia and get her to you know, do a little detour of sorts from our tour just so that we can taste this. Just makes oh. it more interesting for me as well. So. Makes it interesting for her as well. Fantastic. Yeah, yeah sure. Uh, I hope I'm not disturbing you. Yeah. Not at all. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. Ramon. See you. Happy eating. Hi. Hi, how are you? Regularly watch your video. Okay. Good hope you time. enjoy them. Yes, thank you. See you. Bye. Bye. So that place where you see all the crowd, mm -hmm. that's where we are headed. Like yeah, yeah, organize it, don't worry. <laughs> Namaskara! Sir, namaste! Kaise ho? Oh, we are chao. Coming all the way from Bangalore. Watching your videos, what else? You know, places you have visited. Huh? I've been, you know, I've been to that, Kanakpura. Huh? Masal dosa, Vasu. Watched all your videos. Okay, thanks. So can I take a selfie with you? Yeah, yeah, sure, you can. <laughs> so some light from here. Oh my God! I told you last time. Thank you. That I will go to Bangalore and tell my Begum that if there is so much green here, so they will definitely say where they are. This shop is coming here. Let's go see the green shop first. Let's cover the bag. <laughs> oh, kya gobi bulate ho isko? <laughs> it's like milk white, you know, that's the way they clean it and they prepare milk. it. Snow white. Snow white. Snow white. Ah, snow white, not the seven dwarfs, but snow white. <laughs> and that Usman dry gobi. Fantastic. Look at it. Look at the oil, Shri. Look at the oil. It's transparent. Okay. Okay. <laughs> So, definitely, this is the same as this. Okay, okay. I'm going to get a phone. 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 I'm going to get a we are standing outside. Our friend was also coming here. Who was it? So, his name is Usman. He was talking about Usman. He was talking about Bangalore Hotel. He was talking about the name of Bangalore Hotel. If I send someone to him, I will call you first. So, remember that. People are saying that I have sent you. There is no food. 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 I thought you are redoing all your episodes. Not really. You know, I came to Mysuru with my wife. Okay. So I wanted her to taste it. 
ಕಮಾನ್ ನಮ್ದು ಎರಡು ಪ್ಲೇಟ್ ಚೆನ್ನಾಗಿದ್ದಾಳೆ ಚೆನ್ನಾಗಿದ್ದಾಳೆ ಥ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಯು ಹಾಯ್ ಹಾಯ್ ನಮಸ್ಕಾರ ಥ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಯು ವೆರಿ ಮಚ್ ಥ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾಪಿ ಗಣೇಶ ಚತುರ್ಥಿ ಹ್ಯಾಪಿ ಗಣೇಶ ಸಿ ಯು ಬಾಯ್ ಒಳ್ಳೇದಾಗ್ಲಿ ಗಾಡ್ ಬ್ಲೆಸ್ ಓಕೆ ವೆರ್ ಆರ್ ಯು ಫ್ರಮ್ ಓಕೆ ನೈಸ್ ನೈಸ್ ಟು ಮೀಟ್ ಯು ವಾಟ್ಸ್ ಯು ನೇಮ್ ಸುಮುಕ ಸುಮುಕ ನೈಸ್ ಸುಮುಕ ಯಾ ಶೋ You can see the gobi more importantly. <laughs> Thank you. Come on. So you have eaten, I know. I've not actually eaten this before. Today we're going to make it. How is it? So I'm happy that we've also introduced you to something new. Huh? What the hype is amazing. You like it? Yes, I do. Yeah. Shri, so is it worth the walk? the 1 km walk to get here definitely and the chutney is very good it's all very clean look at the way he's organized the cucumber there's no blemishes the onions it's all you see is misapla misapla is basically how they keep all the vegetables and all together i've not even seen hotels that are that neat he takes great pride in his work look at the way his son is mixing that gobi there with the ladle when you have that sort of an approach the food has to be good right it shows it shows and it tastes also so well ರೇನಿ ಡೇ ಇದ್ರೆ ಲೈಕ್ ಪಕೋಡ ಥರ ಗೋಬಿ ಪಕೋಡ ದಿಸ್ ಅಟ್ ಬಿಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಸ್ವೀಟ್ನೆಸ್ ದಟ್ ಯು ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಟೇಸ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ಸ್ವೀಟ್ನೆಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಸ್ವೀಟ್ನೆಸ್ ಅ ಶುಗರ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಕ್ವಾಲಿಫ್ಲಾ ಆಸ್ ದಟ್ ಗೋಬಿ ಇಸ್ ಡೀಪ್ ಫ್ರೈಡ್ ಇನ್ ದಟ್ ಹಾಟ್ ಟೆಂಪರೇಚರ್ ಇನ್ ಇವನ್ ದ ವೇ ಹಿ ಕುಕ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಕೀಪ್ ಸ್ಟರಿಂಗ್ ಇಟ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಹಿ ಕುಕ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ ರಾದರ್ ಜೆಂಟ್ಲಿ ದೆನ್ ಹಿ ರೇಸಸ್ ದ ಟೆಂಪರೇಚರ್ ಸೊ ಹಿ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ವೇಟ್ಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ಆಲ್ ದ ಮಾಯಿಶ್ಚರ್ ಟು ಎಸ್ಕೇಪ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದಟ್ ಗೋಬಿ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ವೆನ್ ದಟ್ ಮಾಯಿಶ್ಚರ್ ಎಸ್ಕೇಪ್ ದೆನ್ ಈಸ್ turns it up so there's a way in which he cooks it's not just the batter not just the masala it's the entire approach right from how he sources his gobi to the way he preps it he removes the skin and all of that and then that's why you get this the usman gobi what mm. is the crunch right of the batter crunchy it's soft inside and then that chutney you can taste the freshness of the mint in that and then the garlic the garlic and also the chili mm. Mm. so good well back at the hotel after that long walk how many kilometers did we walk uh, so about 4 kilometers 4 kilometers yeah 4 kilometers and about 2 hours 30 minutes exactly you know i think when you are on experiences like these i think the person who's with you makes that difference right, right. So I think Sia from Gully Tours who led us on this group did a fantastic job of uh, explaining to us those little nuggets that uh, made the walk very interesting and of course towards the end we had to hijack a walk and veer it towards Usman Gobi so I hope you enjoyed that whole experience of this walk so if you're in Mysore I think this uh, Gully Tour walks comes highly recommended if you like history and also a bit of food that's thrown in I'm told they're running this walk for the last 10 years definitely uh, check it out I'm going to place a link and the contact details in the video description below so I think that's it for this particular vlog uh you know we're not really cutting it formally we're not really ending it formally because we don't really know where each episode where each vlog will end in this series uh, but for whatever it's worth i hope you're enjoying this vlog series if you do give it a big thumbs up and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and we'll see you on the next one bye 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 uh, so you're not going to do that dinner no. well we also have dinner planned here uh, at the restaurant right behind us beautiful setting here at the royal orchid 
So I think Sri is going to rest a bit. We have a busy morning tomorrow, and hopefully, I will go there and savor some of the dishes that the chefs have prepared. Originally a table for two, but sadly now it will be a table for one. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> ditcher. Food ball was I accompanied, right? Huh. I could have ditched this one. <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> well, I can't argue with that. Bye for now. <laughs>